What is up everyone, welcome back to another YouTube video. Um, in today's video, we're going to be looking at a solution I couldn't find for a while as I'm also a beginner learner like you, yourselves. And basically it's simulating the garment in an animation. Now what you'll find if you are, if you are watching this is that um, your garment's like flying around, doing crazy things, bouncing up and down, and it really doesn't look realistic at all. Um, so after like some deep diving on YouTube, I finally found a video that was like 40 minutes long and he, this guy spoke about it for two minutes. Um, so I just want to get straight to the point, cover that and really help you guys animate your, your garments so that they're not just bouncing around crazy. In this video, you're checking now, you're going to see how it is bouncing around, doing all that crazy stuff. And then once I show you these steps, you'll see how much better it looks. So basically, um, you can see I've got my garments here. Everything looks Gucci. Um, what we're going to do first is we're just going to select all um, from here. We're going to apply a solidify, um, set it to around 80% normally works good. Um, and then once we've done that, we can then go um, into our simulation quality settings. You guys can set your framework to whatever you want. I'm just going to have it at 30 just for this video. And then by default, it's set up to this. Now your time step, um, from what I understand is what affects your cloth simulation the most. Um, so uh, just set this thing to point 0.1 and you should be good to go. Uh, from there, you can just save it as a preset. I've already got mine time step zero 01. Um, so I'm just going to open up that. And then for future animations, you already have that set um, and you can adjust it as you want. Now what you'll see is when I do run the animation, then you'll see how much better it looks. Um, you can see when I'm just going through the preview, that things aren't bouncing around, it's not going crazy, it looks clean still, um, and there's no issues that look like it's not really realistic. Now, it's not going to look great for every garment that you do, depending on your physical properties. But what I'd suggest is when you go into your property editor, after selecting your, your garment, is that you go into solidify, and then just tweak that a bit. The lower you go, the less it will hold together, and the higher you go, the stiffer it will get. If this video did help you guys out, please make sure to drop a sub or like or comments. It would be greatly appreciated. Uh, this garment itself is part of a three-part series I'm busy working on uh, where we just go over making some Nike um, garments off the Nike.com site. Um, so yeah, if you do want to stick around for that, drop a sub. It will hopefully be dropping in the next week or so depending on how much work I've got to do. So yeah, have a good one. Thanks so much for the support. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.